Hello and welcome to another Wix video podcast. Today we'll be talking about the upgrade from the Wix 33376 to the new Wix 33976. The new product offers some distinct advantages, such as an integrated lid, specially enhanced phenolic resin media for superior water handling, and a self-venting drain valve for easy servicing. First, let's look at a typical housing in which both the previous and new designs may be installed. You can see the opening into which the filter is installed, the center tube on the housing's interior, and the area where the gasket seals the housing. Be mindful that there can be variations in housings depending on year and model. Okay, let's install the previous design filter into the housing. If we take a look, we see that the gasket is retained by the filter. We also see that a retainer ring is required to hold the filter in the housing. Okay, let's install the previous design filter into the housing. Now we insert the filter into the housing and thread on the retainer ring, being careful not to cross the threads. Okay, let's install the new design filter kit into the housing. The first thing that is different is that we install the gasket onto the housing. With the upgraded design, we no longer need to use a retainer ring because it is integrated into the filter kit. Installation is fairly straightforward. Just thread the filter kit onto the housing, being careful not to cross-thread the lid. Complete installation by torquing the lid to 25 newton meters. Remember to follow the safety precautions and recommended procedures for purging air from the fuel delivery system found in your vehicle's owner's manual. Also, be sure to dispose of all used filters in accordance with all regulations that apply. Thanks for watching, and we welcome you to go online and check out our other offerings that include industry news, technical bulletins, and more.